What's up, guys? CT Kidney here. And uh, we're gonna get attacked by this bitch. Uh, uh, let's just get this out of the way first. So I don't recall if um, the last let's play I did was right here. Because uh, for some reason, Fraps doesn't really like recording them. Um, when the folder is full, and I don't, I don't like that. But you know, I just completely emptied it, made sure everything was uh, uploaded, so we're good. This should record. Okay. <laughs> so, you guys missed a couple of parts because well, they didn't record. It sucks. I know. But that's just how it is. What do I get from this? No. The Sentinel's Pawn, the Warden's Pawn. Wait a minute. Are these... Yes! I love these quests. The, this is... I love, I love this quest. These quests. The Sentinel's Pawn, the Warden's Pawn. Look at that. The Sentinel... The warden. Sentinel making sure no one gets in. Didn't do his job because we just walked right in here. Warden making sure no one gets out. Didn't do his job because, I mean, everyone got out. <laughs> Marble slab. Complete the Sentinel's game. Alright, now all we got to do is we got to make sure that these guys... Are uh, going. We need to, I think, get it to go full circle. Huh. Nothing there. How the hell do you? What? Hmm. There we go. <laughs> Good. No, I do not remember how to do this, so bear with me. Got it. Sentinel's pawn completed. Hell yeah. Now, find and use the warden's pawn. The warden's pawn is all the way down here. Just used our burst because we can. Because we're going to need it for, the ne for this next game. I don't think we will though. Stone slab. Now this. I hate this game. The Warden's game. Alright, let's see. See statues. A true Warden does not face outward, searching for signs of danger. A true Warden keeps his gaze inward, always focusing on protecting his quarry. Okay, so they all gotta face. Huh? Oh shit, it's like one of these. Uh, you go down there. Gonna need you up there. You down there. You go there for now. We're gonna move you there. Get you over there. Go there. You go in there. You go there. And you go there. We're good. So. Thoroughly investigated the warden, thoroughly investigated the sentinel. Ah, we can do that. Now, hmm, thoroughly investigate. Hmm, hmm, yes, man, yes, a fine statue, yes. Yes. Yeah. Place the pawn in there. How long is it going to move? 
Hey, are you going to help us? You're going to help us, right? Right? You're going to help us? No, you're going to kill us. Okay. You know what? While I'm fight while you're getting killed by the the damages, you know, I'll just go ahead and activate this guy cuz you're going to die from the damages. So the warden was a dick. Didn't do shit. Oh, the sentinel's a dick too. Okay. We. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. While we're doing this, we should uh, sign up for a random battleground. I would enjoy a Rothy because or not a Rothy, but a uh, Alterac Valley because Alterac Valley gives hella experience. Huh? The Titans Trove. Trove of the Watchers. Hehe. <laughs> now we don't need this. Ooh, two gold. Yeah, it sells for two gold. That's uh, it's pretty nice. How about you this? Legacy of the... Huh? Oh, there, there, there was a monk inside there. He must have buffed us. What a nice guy. So. Huh? Oh, hi. So. No, I'm not trying to kill you. I need to bring this stuff to Mr. Blam. Ah, dude's killing trogs. Uh, so we're gonna take the spear. I'm gonna freaking attack you because you suck, freaking trog. Not even a playable race, little bitch. Actually, I could. I can't imagine why no one would. No one would ever freaking play a trog. Trogs suck. Report to Rare at Dragon's Mouth. Dragon's Mouth. Blah. So, goes to 48, but we're level 48. I think we're just going to get to 50 here, because there are a lot of quests here. We're nowhere near the end of this. And I never actually completed the full uh, Badlands quest line. I have only gotten to oh, the one we just did with the Sentinel and the Warden. That's the farthest I've gotten, so I don't know what the hell to do now. Honestly. <laughs> Wasn't there, like, a big fucker here? Like a friggin' huge... Yeah, whatever. Well. These guys give the funniest fucking quests in the game, but I already did them, and it didn't record. So I'm pissed. So basically what they do is, they tell stories, right? The day the Deathwing showed up. Now, obviously, Deathwing was here, as you can see. <laughs> so what happened was, this guy tells you a story that he walked all the way through this. Deathwing was on the other side, and he just walked up and punched him in the face. Because he can, because he's a fucking dwarf. This guy tells a story where he built a device. Actually, it's right here in my inventory. Uh, right here. Tazel Wrench's Shrinker. And this guy is Tazel Wrench. So what he did was, he shrunk the world. No, he didn't. Sh he didn't make himself grow at all. He just shrunk the world, cause yeah. And then he grabbed Deathwing and slammed him into the ground, cause he was like huge. And then this guy right here tells a story that he was on his motorbike. You know, oh man, I wish I could freaking show, I wish it didn't, uh, I wish it recorded. He was on his motorbike, right? And you're playing through all of this, by the way. Yeah, you're, you're playing as the person doing all of this. And he told a story, he was on his freaking motorbike, and there were all these hot chicks. Yes, hot chicks. And you can pick one. I think it was Night Elf 
human or uh, orc or blood elf. Yeah, that was that was with the choices, and you pick one, and then you fly on your motorbike, and you punch Deathwing, and and you and you kill Deathwing. And yeah, that's the stories. That's yeah, those guys. They're they're funny. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. This episode, we need glyphs. We gotta get some glyphs. This will interrupt our leveling a bit. Probably take about ten minutes. Oh my god, I want to get that. Hmm. Pretty good. Alright, so what glyphs are we going to get? Major glyphs? I don't fucking know. Let's see. Face silence, fury, fire, and bear form. Also, silence is the target for three seconds. But triggers are 15. That's pretty cool, though. Alright, we'll get that one. Why not? Uh. Ooh, gotta go. Okay, cat. Almost forgot. Rejuvenation. No. Shred. We don't. We are, we are not feral. Uh, Skull Bash is a pretty good attack. Moon Beast, you can cast Healing Touch. Yes! While in Moon, we are getting this one. This one? Maybe Survival Instincts. Maybe Survival Instincts. Actually, do we even get Survival Instincts? Or is that just for Feral? Uh, I don't see Survival Instincts. No, I guess it's just for Feral. Alright, so, we doing work or are the Horde going to win? We really need to, yeah, let's go over there and help the fight. Because, you know, it may seem like we're going to win, but honestly, one skilled person can take on three people that are average. That's, just, that's what I like about this game. If you have skill, you're going to win. Unless you're a Frost Mage, because... Then if you're a frost mage, I mean, if you if you try and go up against a frost mage with anybody, you're gonna lose. It just it doesn't work out. And also, I have something to show you guys if we are ever in the actual middle. And it's fucking hilarious. Right now we're being attacked, so we're gonna put Sonari and Ward on ourselves. Put a rejuve up also. Gonna go into Kitty Cat. Because we're being attacked. I see, like I told you, it looks like we might win the fight. They got that powdered up in there. He's dead now. Bitch. Get crit. Put Rejuve on. Get back in the fight. Oh man, I hope this one's gonna be. Wait, what the fuck? No. You're gonna be dazed. Trying to catch up to this fucker, he's trying to run away. Alright, let's get back there. But the thing is, holding the middle does absolutely nothing if the guy if the one guy up there is gonna get his ass whooped. But right now he's looking like he's gonna get his ass whooped, so we're gonna go help him. See, cause the thing with Eye of the Storm is, and I think I've already explained this, but just in case I didn't. Uh, the flag, the strange flag, it's got extra range. What you got to do is you bring the flag to one of the bases you control. And however many judges, you, uh, however many uh, bases you control is the more points you get. Alright, so we just got feared for seven seconds because, you know, warlocks, they do that shit. And that guy's going to clean up. Alright, we're good. He's going to clean up, right? 
So we gotta get in the middle. How's Mage Tower? Ooh, we gotta go help Mage Tower. There's a fucking lock right there. Man, anyone that's ever fought a warlock, you know what I'm talking about. And it's especially an affliction warlock, those fuckers. So annoying. Affliction warlocks are like, you get them to no HP, right? They're literally at, like, what, 1% HP? You get feared, and then they heal like a motherfucker. All the while doing damage to you. So, it's like, affliction, man. You need some serious CC to take that down. Like, if you're a rogue, affliction locks are okay. If you're a mage, affliction locks are okay. But if you're some shit like, um... I don't know, like, say us, Boomkin. Uh, we don't really have a lot of CC. I mean, we can stop their spells with this and this. That's it. That's all we can do. So yeah, I mean we we don't really have a lot of CC to stop them until we get Hurricane. Oh my God, Hurricane! Hurricane is gonna be fun. So we're just gonna kill this guy because he's just gonna stand there because he's smart. This guy's fucking smart. Just gonna stand there and get his ass whooped. Make sure a warrior should be taking it. I mean, we are a druid. We should, actually, yeah, I should probably take the flag. So I can run it back pretty fast. No! Get back. Put a rejuve. We got a healing druid back here, so we're good. Just gonna put our dots on everybody. So we can actually get some procs, maybe. Shit, we're disorientated. Gonna put Rejuve on, put all our shit on. Trying to get the hell out. My god, we're stunned. Frick. No! Alright, they just stormed the middle. They stormed that shit. <laughs> My god. <laughs> I don't even know how many people were there. Gotta be at least seven, though. Because they just stormed that place like it was no one's business. Alright, this dude's good. Damn. You know what? Let's do some friggin' Metal Gear Kitty Cat up in here. Yeah, let's try for some Metal Gear Kitty Cat. See, that dude's good, because he knows, he knows not to cap the flag unless we have control of the middle. Right oh my god, oh my god. Stay there, stay there. Damn it, he moved. What a betch. Shit. Metal Gear Kitty Cat! Didn't work. Fuck. Uh, yeah, we're gonna die. <laughs> we're dead. <laughs> I fucked that up so bad. Oh my god, we are dead as hell. See, the thing is, if we're not feral, <laughs> we don't really, um, we don't have improved stealth. So people can probably see us from, uh, especially if they're higher level at this level. That's only level 49, so that'll, that'll be a higher level. Yeah, see that guy's level 40. Look at that freaking health. Shit, man. Like, that's what happens. Alright, let's try Metal Gear Kitty Cat again. See, this guy's smart. I like this guy. He knows how to play the game. Very rare occurrence, <laughs> I can honestly say. Right, let's try this Metal Gear Kitty Cat. If we get right up next to him, we should be able to do it. Metal Gear Kitty Cat, Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Hide behind the rock. Yeah. 
Can we blow that fucker off? I don't know. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. What the fuck? Oh, we got him. We got him. Yes, I am. Ha <laughs> ha, bitch. Did that actually work? <laughs> Dude, I'm good at this game. Get the fuck off me. Did that shit actually work? Oh my god. Oh, what the fuck? We're disorientated. But we took damage. <laughs> Bucks can go. We're not gonna cap this. No, we have no help here. Yeah, we're fucked. No one, we had no help. Now they're just going to pick up the flag. Do it. I can't believe that actually worked. Though we almost had it. <sighs> it would have been fucking funny. But where did the dude with the flag go? Huh? Anyone see? Alright, whatever. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Wait, we have middle. Yeah, we have control of the middle right now. So the flag was dropped. We already used dash, so we probably shouldn't pick it up again. Ezreal picked up the flag. What the fuck? No. We're going to put the damages on you. Because you're a little bitch. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Later, bitch. Oh, wow. What a fuck. Goes in Ice Cube. Not even a great rapper. Wow. He says help. Grom means help. See, that's how you know I've been playing this game for too damn long. I know the language. <laughs> Shit. We out. Now we gotta kill this dude's fucking pet. Because he's gonna be a bitch. Damn, I love those two star friggin' star surges right after the other. Now they're too far up, we can't knock them off. Mm, this guy maybe. It'll go kitty cut! Nope, not even close. We're stunned. Wait, what are we stunned by? I don't recognize that stun. Oh, it's a shaman. It's a friggin' totem. Yeah, it must be a totem, because I don't I don't recognize that at all. Frick, we're asleep. That dude's dead. That good. Do we get him? Did we actually get him? No. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Look at that dumb shit, and he's covering up there. What an ass. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna knock him off. He's gonna be like, what the fuck? Alright, first, check his buffs. Uh, Blessing of Kings. It's a paladin buff, probably. Maybe a paladin nearby. <laughs> Man, I'll get kitty cat. Huh? Yep, Paladin. Give you a redo, put Sonarian Ward on you, because he's going for you. You you won't you won't get out damaged, I'm telling you right now. He that's a dupe that's a prop pally. Prop pallies don't do too much. Yeah, you won't get out damaged, I'm telling you. Prop pallies don't really do much. 
retribution that are like ridiculous. We can't go Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Yeah, we can. Oh, wait, no, no, we can't. Because we stop taking this shit over if we do. Yeah, if you go in stealth and you're trying to capture a point, it doesn't work. Ah, shit. Now he knows he hit something. Damn it, we didn't get him. Bark skin? This dude's affliction, isn't he? There, die. Alright, we're good. Dude's running the flag. Pretty nice. Yeah, we've got this one. That's pretty nice. Let's try to get one more full uh, Metal Gear Kitty Cat up in there. Anyone there? Now we won't get a Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Oh, this dude's going into the middle. We won. I have the storm victory. And we leveled. Nice. We are now level 49. Go run a battle gun again, and what just happened? Huh? Oh, he already pro. Oh, okay, you're a wolf. Get away, wolfie. No, oh, it's out of the storm again. <laughs> Alright, so in one level we get this. And I forgot to do. And we get to uh, derp, derp, derp. We get to go to Outland in nine levels. And that means in nine levels, that'll probably be, I don't know, five parts. Five parts or so, yeah. Uh, we will. We will, um, be in Outland. And we will have two hour long videos instead of one. Because once we get to Outland, well, we are, uh, we're not gonna do shit in an hour.
So this is going to be our route for Outland. So this is, this is gonna be our route for. Ah, oh, damn it! We can't go to the regular map while we're in a battleground. All right. See if we can get a Metal Gear Kitty Cat going on. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. There's one guy. <laughs> There's one guy. That means they're gonna invade somewhere. So we're gonna go um up in here. Cause I saw more people going. Yeah, way more horde went to this side. Yeah, as you ran out of ruins are coming. Oh shit. Holy shit. There's hella people over here. Oh my god. Oh my god. We will not win this. Yeah, we're not winning this fight. Best chance I have is to blow a bitch off a bridge. Wow, you're cool down there just shooting shit. Alright, so we lost that one. There's no chance of us getting that. There's no, no, there really is nowhere to help, honestly. Huh. I'm gonna go see if I can't get. Alright, so there's one dude in there. He's fighting. Two hunters versus probably a healer. Priest, yeah. Getting the damages on you. Okay, we got the damages on that guy. Who has the flag? Uh, the horde apparently had it. Damn it. Ugh. No. Rogue. Get away. No stealthy for you. Fairy fire. Suck it. Gonna pop our burst here. That's not even ward up. Yeah, we're dead here. No chance. Alright, um... We're probably going to lose as well. Well, we can get FRR, but whatever. We could get Fell Weaver for ruins. See if we can get a full metal, uh, full metal, metal gear kitty cat going on. Metal gear kitty cat, can we get one? Damn it. We'll have to use it to stop the flag. No, no flag for you. Oh shit, we got pulled in by something. The hell? Wait, but death knights aren't in this, oh my god. Death knights. So where are we going to go now? <sighs> well, we're going to take that one over. But we're not going to do it in time. They're going to cap. Let's see if we can get a Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. Metal Gear Kitty Cat. No flag for you. No. Bad no flag. We just gotta stay alive as much as possible. 
And, oh, did we get full metal? Yeah, we got Metal Gear Kitty Catted. Whatever. Hmm. I don't think we're going to win this one, so this is just a waste of time. So, we're going to leave. See, there's a strategy to leveling. Battlegrounds are amazing if you're going to win. If you are not going to win, you might as well leave within the first five minutes. It's determ. It now there's never, and I, I'm I'm sorry to say this, but there's never any miracle come from behinds. It's always determined within the first like five minutes if you're gonna win the battleground or not. And it was determined there that we're fucked. So I'm just leaving. Freaking ogres. What the hell? What am I doing? All right, here. Okay. <gasps> Summer. It's the summer's festival. Now, where the hell do we go? Here. Terrence Storm. Well, you must have an awesome name. What the hell there is, Rhea? Man, we have a lot of quests here. That's nice. The glass cannon. <laughs> Damn, we have a lot of quests here. Damn, we have a lot of quests here. If we do all these quests... Oh, wait, now this is... Oh, wow. Free experience. Do not mind if I do. Now, what we're going to do here is... Hmm? Hi. we're gonna do here is we're gonna dance around this thing ribbon dance three minutes six minutes experience gain from killing monsters increased this goes all the way up to an hour by the way and we were spinning we're spinning we're spinning 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 we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, 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 we're spinning, we're not spinning. Did it stop? No, it stopped. Okay, well, let's use it again. Did summer bonfire. Alright, what do we got? We got increased critical strike. I'm in shape shifted for him. And we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, 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 we're spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, 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 fucking spinning, we're spinning, we're spinning, 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 and we're spinning, we're spinning, and spin, and spin. We we're spinning chicken. I'm sorry this takes so long, guys. Let me tell you, it's worth it when we're doing this many quests. Alright, we'll get that up for an hour. Wait a minute. What the hell? Let's go to our quest log, Badlands. Oh, uh, the Searing Gorge. 
We're not going to the Searing Gorge. I, I don't like the Searing Gorge a lot. I'm, I'm going to be honest. Searing Gorge is, uh, right around here. Searing Gorge. I don't like it. I don't like it that much, to be honest. I'm much more fr a fan of the Burning Steeps, which we could go to right now. And it will have better quests. So we're going to do that, actually, because it will have better quests. Yeah, it'll give more experience or quests. So Searing Gorge, or not Searing Gorge, but, um, what's it called? Burning Steeps. Can we actually get to the Burning Steeps? I hope so. Because there is something in the Burning Steeps I need to show you guys. It's lore on a stick. Technically it's not, but you know you know what I mean. It's like freaking someone's lore. It's ridiculous. Alright, we can't get in there, can we? There's no way, is there? Nope, only way in is through the Burning Steeps. Or is through Searing Gorge. So, can we get to the Searing Gorge? What's this? Searing Gorge, okay. Uh, we can get to the Searing Gorge. So, the, yeah, the only way in is through the Searing Gorge through Black Rock Mountain. Black Rock Mountain. Uh... So much lore, so little time. Actually, yes, yeah, so a little time indeed. Ruins of Kargath. And we are now entering the Searing Gorge. This is the main quest line for um, dwarves and shit. For uh, the, the Dark Iron Dwarves. This is where all the Dark Iron Dwarves hang out. I don't know why. They just do. It's showing. Huh? Dead spider. Oh, someone's been here. So now we just go to Black Rock Mountain. Black Rock Mountain, here we come. Now, the thing about Black Rock Mountain is, it was the hideout for a uh, for a group of uh, orcs that were once part of the horde called the Blackrock clan as you would imagine there were several clans of orcs the dragon maw the black rock all the others oh god can't even remember them all so yeah most of them joined the horde uh, but some of them decided not to. You. <gasps> Give me this. We fucking found a rare spell. I never even fucking knew this thing existed. I never even knew this thing existed. What the fuck? Anyone else in here? No. I never knew you existed. Come here, you little bitch. Why, you look fucking cool. Dude, if a hunter came in here, god damn, is he one of them? You look ridiculous. Because, you know, there's never anything in here. But apparently there is. God damn. I, I, honestly, that's never happened before. I've never seen that fucker. Alright, so this is where we're going to go. We're going to go to the Burning Steeps. This is Black Rock Mountain. Where all... This is where all the cool uh, Black Rock Orcs used to hang out. Before the Alliance came and invaded. 
Now, why did they invade? Well, I mean, we didn't really like them hanging around here. Why is that? Because it's on our land. Kalimdor is the Horde's mainland. Eastern Kingdoms is the Alliance's mainland. Now, what would they be doing on our land? Uh, trying to take over Lordaeron. Which, you know... Uh, actually, Lordaeron was over on Kalimdor, because I'm smart, I think. No, it's here. I'm an idiot. Yeah, it's here as well, it's right there. So, I'm smart. Sorry. <laughs> there is the lore. I know you guys see that statue. I know you guys see that fucking statue. I like that fucking statue. That, that is Anduin Lothar, the Lion of Azeroth. Now, if we can get close enough to read a pla to read the plaque without these friggin' orcs trying to kill us, is there even a plaque, or is it just a statue of Anduin Lothar? There's a plaque, right? Right? No, it's just a statue. Damn it! I thought there was a plaque. I'm an idiot. Anyway, and it went low with our everybody. The Lion of Azeroth. Now, he was the leader. Yeah. Uh, he was the general, I believe. Either the gen yeah, I think he was the general uh, for a long time of the Alliance forces. But, you know, he, um, he kind of died right there. Literally, they built a statue of him over his grave. Not even kidding. So, yeah. Uh, Anduin Lothar was the general for a while until he was killed by Orgrim Doomhammer. Orgrim Doomhammer was eventually slain. I think he was captured in that fight. It was a huge fight. Obviously, the Horde won because um, Anduin was killed. So that sucks. And because Anduin was killed, uh, Orgrim Doomhammer had a very unique strategy. Remove the head of the beast, and it all falls apart. Now, what this means is, kill the general, no one knows what the fuck to do. It's wrong. <laughs> I mean... No, that's just wrong. Because the Alliance, kind of, they know what to do. I mean, the Alliance was uh, pretty pretty good on knowing what to do. And, uh, ironically, when Orgrim Doomhammer was captured by a uh, Tyrellian, uh, oh yeah, what am I saying? I, I completely missed the entire battle. So... Uh, the Alliance was pushing the Horde back to, uh, to, derp, 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 to the Searing Gorge. Obviously, they won, because, look, you can see the Black Rock uh, clan. That is now individual, uh, not part of the Horde anymore. Why? I don't exactly remember. But it was a pretty good reason, if I, if I can remember. So, yeah. The Horde won, or the Blackrock clan won. They did not win that fight, but they took it back. Because obviously they are here. Or I believe we're still fighting over it, but whatever. Let me get back to the main, the battle. The battle was ridiculous. There were people dying everywhere. It was just, it was, it was your traditional bloodbath, basically. The Black Rock clan, what did they have that the Horde did not already have? Well, they had dragons. That's right, they had dragons. These whelps right here, they grow into dragons. And the Black Rock clan controlled these dragons. Now, why the hell would the Horde need dragons? Because the Alliance doesn't have dragons. That's as simple as that. 
so basically, Orgum Doom Hammer. Uh, he's like, I gotta kill the general, and no one will know what to do. So he goes, and they have a pretty big fight. I mean, it lasted for like a couple of minutes. And if if there's a one v one fight like that, and it lasts a couple of minutes, you know, it's getting ridiculous. Until, uh, what happened? Lothar made a very, very small mistake, and Orgrim Doomhammer he he took control of that mistake. He uh, he capitalized on it. What he did. I think was he um, raised his shield up to block, and uh, the doom and doom hammer. He brought down his hammer, and it broke the shield, and it bashed Anduin's head in. Not fun, not fun at all. So after that, Terralian, who uh, who idolized Lothar, he saw this. And, you know, being a paladin, he has spiritual powers and shit, and he's like, he's a warrior. It's basically a mix of a priest and a warrior. Bitch goes super saiyan. Not even kidding. Like, he goes fucking super saiyan. Just dominates Doomhammer and captures him. And ironically, without Doomhammer, <laughs> the Horde lost the fight. Because they didn't know what the fuck to do. They didn't have their general. Ironic, isn't it? Yeah, I know. And I believe Doomhammer died in prison. But I am not 100% sure. Oh, no. What am I saying? Um, he, yeah, he died? Uh, I can't remember, really, honestly. God damn, it's been so long since I'm going to have to go through the lore again for uh, next episode so I can correct all this shit. Because I'm probably... I'm not wrong about the battle. Orgrim was captured. Um... And, uh, Lothar died. Terralian went fucking Super Saiyan on Doomhammer's ass. And, uh, yeah. So, yeah. The original Super Saiyan, Terralian. Just putting it out there. And now they have a statue of him. Right there. That the orcs have not torn down yet for some reason. That baffles me. It really does. So I think, um, as soon as we turn into these quests, I am just going to stop recording. Or, you know, I'm going to check how long we've been recording, because I don't know. Honestly, hold on. We need one more red whelp. We need to free one red whelp. That is a bronze whelp. We need a red whelp. Yeah, whelpy well, you know, let's go, um, Metal Gear Kitty Cat. We need a red whelp. Green whelp. Blue whelp. Bronze whelp. There's gonna be every kind up here except the red whelp, I can guarantee it. Just my luck, right? And hey, black rock whelper. Get it? They're whelps. <laughs> red, blue. Red whelp! Man, I mean, he's gotta kill this fucker. Let's get the damages on him. Oh wow, there's one of every freaking color in here. Derp. So we need one more broodling. And I'm gonna check how long we've been recording as soon as I turn these quests in. Uh, 
Oh yeah, and I almost forgot. Um, after Lothar died, I believe it was Turalyon who became the new general. But I'm not completely sure. That's why I got I got to recap on this lore. Probably gonna do that like right after this. Got the book like right friggin' next to me, but <laughs> I'm not even gonna look at it. All right, so. Uh, actually, perfect time to stop recording because the dog is going to start barking, and I don't know why. So, after I turn in these quests, let's check how long I have been recording. 